What is going on, guys? It is New York Sports Up here, and I am back at it with a, another New York Yankees video. And in this video, I'm going to rip the New York Yankees to pieces in this video. So again, if you're a Yankees fan and you like seeing me ranting, drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you do not miss any of my videos. And most of my videos on the channel are going to be New York Yankees rants, because that's the only content they give me, this team gives me. So it's going to be another rant. I'm going to rant. I'm going to rip this team to pieces. I'm going to go absolute ballistic about this pathetic, heartless, gutless, shameful, disgraceful, pathetic, egregious baseball team, and I am going to rip them apart, all right? Yankees lost four to nothing. They had three flipping hits in this game. Montgomery pitched pretty well, but they had three hits in the game. Um... Nobody played well in this game besides no, I can't even I can't even talk about anyone who played well in this game. Nobody played well in the lineup. And Montgomery actually pitched pretty well, and the bullpen was alright, but they didn't score a single run. What is else what else is there to say? They didn't score a run. I'm not even gonna break down this game because there's nothing to say about this game. All I'll say is Monty uh, Montgomery pitched pretty well. That's all I'll say. He pitched well. Six innings, three runs. He was good. Had one bad inning. Outside of that, he was fine. Uh, the bullpen was all right, but the offense was nowhere to be found, as usual. Um, I do not care on how many players we, we didn't have in the lineup. You should have more than three hits. You should at least score a run against a guy who had a 5.5 earn run average coming into the game. He had a 5 ERA. Right. This is like the third time... Eduardo Rodriguez has shut this lineup down. It's pathetic. He's not even a good pitcher. He's having an awful season, and the Yankees can't touch him. It's pathetic. And then they brought in this kid, Hauk, who also shut us down, who's also not a good pitcher whatsoever, and he shut us down like it was nothing. How do you come into this game with a lineup with Trey Ambergie, whatever the hell his stupid name is? Who else do they have in there? Uh, Rubnet Odor in the three hole. We had Caillou in the six hole, who's a freaking trash can. How do you expect to win games with this pathetic lineup? I don't care how many players you have injured and how many players you have on the COVID list. Put a better freaking lineup out there. Call up Florial. You don't call up this Ambergie. The guy's the guy's trash. Why would you call him up? He sucks. Hoi Jun Park. He's trash. I don't care how he did in the AAA. He's a garbage baseball player. Why would you call up these assholes up to the big leagues? Call up Florial and call up who else? Call up one of the uh, one of the other hitters in the minor leagues. Is Dietrich still in the minor leagues? Call up, call him up. Who why are you calling up these scrubs? And why are you hitting Odor third? This this lineup today was pathetic. Pathetic, disgraceful, and I cannot believe that Aaron Judge, an asymptomatic, who is asymptomatic, has to be on the COVID IL for 10 days? He's asymptomatic, and it's probably a false positive because usually when you test positive for COVID, you have symptoms. He's asymptomatic. He's probably going to test negative at some point, and he'll, he'll be back eventually, but I don't think it's going to be 10 days. But still, if, 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 he, if he is on the IL for 10 days, I'm going to be really pissed off. I really am. I, I, I thought it would get—I thought the Yankees would, you know, not play well, but— you know, I didn't know if I didn't know it get this bad. I mean, being a New York Yankees fan is, is miserable enough. I didn't think you could lose your best player. It's just, just miserable being a fan of this team. We are the most tortured fans in all of sports. I say it every video. The New York Yankees are the have the most tortured fans in all of sports. We have dealt. We have put up with this bullcrap for years, and now, in this video, I am not going to be nice anymore. I am going to rip this team. Now, I I've, I've been ripping them the whole video, but. There's another player that is really pissing me off right now, and that's Luke Voigt. If you wondered why he's not in the lineup tonight, well, he went on the IL with our best player, Urshela, Cortez, Loizaga, and Higashioka, all in the COVID IL. And Luke Voigt goes on the 10-day IL with a bone bruise. A freaking bone bruise. Lou Gehrig played baseball while he, was, he, had, a disease, uh, he had ALS, and he was playing baseball. And he was putting up Hall of Fame numbers. And Luke Voigt can't play with his whole team injured. He can't tough it up and play on the field because he has a bone bruise. You know what? Screw you, Luke Voigt. I hope you stay on the IL for the rest of the season. You're pathetic. 
you throw your teammates under the bus by going out, by going on the IL with an injury that it's it's a wimpy injury. Screw you, Luke Voigt. I hope you I hope you get traded in this offseason. Pathetic. A bone bruise. Get the hell out of here with that. And also, did you, did you hear Rugnetto Doors post-game comments saying, I believe in my teammates? You know, this is still a long season. Yeah, how many times are we gonna say that? This is a long season, a lot of time left. Season starts now. How many times are we gonna say that? This season is over. You're pathetic, Odor. You're a pathetic baseball player. And how do you have how do you have the gall to come out in in your post-game interview and say, I believe in my team? Shut the hell up, dude. You're pathetic. Who else? Who else do I want to really, really rant on? Um, nah, that's it. You know what? Oh, I forgot. I almost forgot. Glaber Torres, you suck. Glaber Torres sucks. Every time he comes up to the plate, it's a lazy, oh well, kind of swing. Doesn't put any effort in. He's an awful defensive shortstop too. He stinks. He has a six, like a like a six thirty OPS. He's trash. We should trade him tomorrow. He's Garbage. And also, Gina Stanton, not John Carlos Stanton, his name is now Gina Stanton because he's a freaking bitch. He came out today and went like 0 for 4 or 3 strikeouts. He sucks. He's an overpaid bum. He's trash. Get that asshole off the team. We should have gotten Christian Yelich. We should have gotten Bryce Harper. I can't stand John Carlos Stanton. Even when he was playing well, I still don't like him. He's an overpaid bum. He's a garbage can. I can't stand him. Every at bat, He's like ahead in the count, and he just wasted by swinging and missing. Like, oh well, it's like a weak hack, just like Labor. It's a weak hack. He sucks. I can't stand him. I really can't stand him. Just another pitiful, pitiful performance. The New York Yankees will not beat the Boston Red Sox once this season. They will go 0 and 19. They suck. I have never been more embarrassed to be a fan of this team. And Brian Cashman should be looking himself in the mirror tonight, and he should be disgusted for putting out this baseball team. And it's only going to get worse from here, guys. It's only going to get worse. We will be under 500 after this series. That's not possible. I take that back. But we will be under 500 after the uh, Philly series. We will be under 500. This team is a joke. I have never been more ashamed to root for this team. I can't stand this team. And this team, every ball player on this team, outside of Garrett Cole, Aaron Judge, and DJ LeMahieu, and a few other players, they are losing pricks. They accept losing. They don't care about the fans. And they are assholes. I can't stand this team. Screw this team. Before I end the video, I just want to say screw this team. And I'll talk to you guys. Probably not tomorrow. I don't feel like making a video about this pathetic team. So the next time I'll have a video, it's probably going to be a, maybe a Knicks video or a Giants video. I don't know what my schedule is you know, up ahead. So I'll talk to you guys. Probably going to be a Yankees video in the near future. Peace.